Hi, thank you for watching On Trail with Tanya. For Labor Day weekend this year, I had the opportunity to check off one of my hiking bucket list adventures, Guadalupe Peak, which is an 8.5 mile round trip hike to the highest point in Texas at an elevation of 8,751 feet. This was the perfect training hike as we prepare for our upcoming Grand Canyon Rim to Rim hike this October. We arrived at the Pine Springs Trailhead at approximately 5.30 a.m., hoisted up our gear, turned on our headlamps, and started our trek up the mountain at about 6 a.m. Within the first mile and a half, we gained approximately 1,400 feet in elevation to a section called Around the Bend. This section was definitely the hardest of the entire trail, but the view of the desert sunrise was a stunning sight to see and the perfect distraction from that strenuous trek. From there, the trail traversed another 1.6 miles along the north facing slope to the campground area. This section was by far my favorite as we trekked through a high elevation forest of pine trees and desert shrubs that were surprisingly fragrant. This section also offered breathtaking views of the surrounding mountains. I was definitely in my element and I took every opportunity to soak it all in. Entering the campground area, I was surprised to see a high elevation meadow with tall pines and desert grass, and I can certainly see how this area would offer a very peaceful retreat. The following mile was just as magical. The views of the desert below gave a really good perspective of just how far we had climbed, and as we scrambled over rock beds and turned corners along cliff sides, I was in awe of the view of El Capitan below, which stands at 8,085 feet and is considered the 10th highest peak in Texas. We took a few minutes in this spot above El Capitan to enjoy a snack and soak in the majestic views, while also grumbling about the clouds that were quickly rolling in. The last half mile stretch to the top of Guadalupe Peak was challenging, but once we reached the summit, I couldn't help but well up with tears. Seeing this stainless steel pyramid in person was a monumental moment in my life and an adventure I've been dreaming about for years now. I did it. That is me. I made it to the top of Texas. Although the cloud cover blocked the views I was hoping for, we did have a few brief moments where the clouds broke just enough to get a sneak peek of the views below, but not enough to really enjoy all the summit has to offer. So that just means I'll need to plan another trip out there. After eating a snack, I took a few minutes to apply some blister tape and changed out my socks before we headed back down the mountain to the Pine Springs Trailhead. The hike was 8.5 miles round trip covering a 3000 foot elevation gain and took us approximately five hours to complete. This included our travel time, breaks, and photo ops. The average temperature was approximately 70 degrees, but did drop to about 60 degrees at the summit. I carried three liters of water and only consumed half, and I definitely would have consumed more water in higher temperatures. I was most grateful for my light pullover jacket at the summit, which protected against the cooler temperature and winds. I was also thankful I brought my trekking poles, which was a tremendous help in navigating the chunky terrain large step ups and step downs, and as well as some areas where there's slippery rocks. Some of my favorite trail features included the footbridge, which was approximately 45 minutes from the summit, as well as the several outcroppings along the way, which offer the perfect opportunity to really enjoy the view of the mountains and get some awesome photos. If you're planning to go on this hike, please be sure to read the information on the National Park Services website listed below and certainly allow yourself plenty of time to really appreciate this hike. It will not disappoint. Until next time, love and light.